Hello everyone, this is Flops86 once again, and welcome back to my LP of uh, 3D Lemmings on the PlayStation 1. Um, we finished the fun difficulty in our previous videos, so now we're going to be embarking on the tricky difficulty. And this is, and this is actually my first time recording today, so I, ha I actually haven't uh, got any progress saved because this game doesn't allow saving on the PlayStation 3 because there's a bit of a glitch with it. But because um, I finished the entire difficulty, that's not really relevant, so I'm just going to get on and play on Tricky. Alright, it's a Jelly Belly graphic set level. Okay. And as always, I'm going to press the preview button so we can have a look at it. Just a bit closer. Okay, this one's got a lot of fake exits, I think. And I think some fake, I think some exits are unreachable no matter what as well. So we've got ten lemmings, we're going to save six. We got the awesome, yeah. We got the awesome Jelly Belly music as well. I believe you only get this on the Jelly Belly levels. This music. Okay, so let's look at camera one, camera two. He usually goes along the general thinking that cameras what camera one is nearest the entrance and camera four is nearest the exit and so forth. So we've got 10 climbers, so each of them is going to get a climber, just in case you turn him to the right exit. Well, we already know this exit is a no-go, because they'll, that's, that's an unfallable distance. Well, it's a fatal fall, as Lemmings players like to s call it. And everyone needs to be able to climb it out of the trapdoor. Okay. Uh, it's a bit hard to see, so... I'm going to use camera one as my movable camera because I always like to have a camera that moves around. Oh god, it's got caught on something then. My bad. Okay, so that one, that first one to the right is impossible as well because it's got a little gap underneath it. I can move the camera. Yeah, there's a gap underneath it. And climbers can't climb walls that got uh, gaps underneath them. So it still turns the lemming around, but they can't climb up it. Okay, so if they turn to the left, it's a teleport there. Question is, which one does it take them to? How many teleport pads elsewhere? I think there's one over there. Yep. I see. Yeah, and that deflector wall is no good because the lemmings will just climb up and over the wall. And teleport pads are no good as well because the lemmings can't physically reach it because that that's just the wall that turns them around. So it's just, I think it's level just a case of seeing, knowing the laws of what climbers do in this game and uh, using that. I think we already know that we've got to go to the left. So I'll just go ahead and do that. And because there's teleports involved, uh, we can't really increase the release rate. Uh, I'm glad to get used to the fact this is not Neolemix either. I've been playing rather a lot of Neolemix today. I've been uh, playing on a. Uh, I've been playing through the Lemmings Reunion custom level pack, which was made by. Uh, Ish a lot on the Lemmings forum. Hope it's, I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. Um, okay, so let's get back to assigning the climbers. Yeah, that's fine. I wonder if you sign. You can't assign tasks while you're on pause. Okay, that's fair enough. Okay, so we don't need to worry about the Lemmings for a bit. Assuming they've gone the right way. I don't understand why the save requirement is six lemmings. Where else are we losing? Where else are we going to lose two more lemmings? Okay, as expected, they came out over here. I was taking a bit of a gamble there. Okay, so it's just a case of uh, 
knowing which ones are possible. All right, that one's impossible because of the gap. That, uh, that as I explained earlier, is a fatal fall. So it's got to go right. Not too, not too hard once you know how to do it. But I think that's the right exit anyway. I think I think I used the wrong word there when I said fatal exit, uh, false, false set, fake exits. I don't think any of them are fake. I think just some of them are impossible to get to, so they're not actually possible to get um, get a lemming through them. Here's my capture software doesn't seem to be timing my videos as well, so I'm going to have to keep track of that. Okay, so we can definitely the less definitely the less that means. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set a timer that goes off after 30 minutes. Just so I know I'm not making the videos too long. Okay. Gomosis, that's an interesting word. far away as well because I don't want to hear I don't want you lot to hear listen to it ticking away. Uh which exit? That time is way too loud, I'm gonna have to turn it off. Okay, I'm gonna have to look down I'm gonna have to use another reference point so oh this is gonna be a bit of trial now because it involves trampolines. Um 40 lemmings 35 to be saved. So yeah, the game's getting a bit tricky now. First one was work work out was um the first one was uh, calculatable, but the second one is not really so so fortunate. Okay, so I don't know why we got the five climbers and the five floaters. So which way do they come out first? They're going left. Okay, so um, I'm just trying to remember what happens in the case of. Um, I don't think, for starters, this exit is going to be it because um, that's the one that the lemmings go to just by having the. Uh, just by carry on the way they're going, so we can discount that exit. Um, I think it's quite a high exit from what I remember, so I'm led to believe it's probably the one closest to me that's facing away from me, or that one on the far left at the back there. I think my cursor's on now. Some of them I think some of them are impossible to get to on this level because of the fact that the uh, it's, it's the same as the last level pretty much. It's just knowing which exit to go to, and it's annoying these are the kind of levels just because. Well, do I need to explain? <laughs> um, I don't think that one up the back's it because they're going to be able to fall off this platform here, and that's going to send them flying. Because the amount, the height you fall from when you fall on a trampoline in this game is a, a big influence, I think. Don't know that for a fact, so I'm going to put a blocker down. Okay, so we'll, we'll be down here now. Hmm. I'm going to I'm going to be gutsy and just put a second blocker down and hope that that exit up the back is the right one. Gotta try it. And we're gonna see it. We're gonna listen to these annoying lemmings again. Right. I don't really like to change cameras on this one. I'm just I'm so used to controlling controlling the camera controls. I don't really need to do it. Right. No, I'll lower it so you can see the trampolines. Yeah, it's right. Wow. We got the correct one first time. That's pretty lucky. 
don't know if you saw the fun level in the previous video, but there was actually red and blue trampolines in that, and I think the blue trampolines were weaker, because it took, um, the jumps were both the same, but for the blue ones, you had to fall from a greater height to achieve the same distance. Trampolines don't really take into into account. You can use, um, you can have, you can have, it doesn't matter about release rate when it comes to lemmings bouncing on trampolines. The only ones you need to be careful of are the, uh, the only things you need to be careful of is teleport pads and rope, rope swings, I think. Uh, rope, uh, rope swings. So if any of them are involved, yeah, you know, like this level, for example, this level could have a rope swing on it because it's that sort of graphic graphics there. Uh, okay, so we're back on an army level. This is the army. I think this one's got four different assault courses. No, okay. I got. I, I'm, I'm particularly wrong about this level. Okay, it's not bad. That I'm only about ten minutes in, and I'm already on the third level. Of tricky. Okay, so the exit is. It's quite hard to tell where the exit is actually. I think the exit's where camp, yeah, because there's a number four next to that one. Okay, so we're gonna have we're gonna have army music, obviously. Yep. <laughs> uh, I think this level's gonna be incredibly 2D. Yeah, there's not even any turners. Look, it's 2D only because it wraps around and uses deflector block. Uh, it's 3D only because it uses deflector blocks and wraps around on itself. Okay, so something important to know is there's a climber wall behind me. Uh, an anti-climber wall. So it doesn't matter if climber lemmings come back on themselves. I didn't uh, take note of how... Oh, we need 20 lemmings. At least the level tells you how many you need. I don't know how many lemmings there are, though. That's the problem. I think there might have been 30 or 40. Okay, so... We need two climbers. Two climbers need to hit this anti climbable wall here, and then um, I think the miner needs to be used later in the level, so we have to use the bomber to blow up the hole here. Okay. So we know what we know we know what needs to be done here at the moment, and they both need umbrellas as well. How we often come out second lemming? Time limits don't seem to be big, such a big such a such anything to worry about in this game either. That's something else I've noticed. I don't remember there ever being a problem with them. Um, I don't really understand why I brought two lemmings over actually. I really hope I haven't fucked myself over there. I don't see why I, sh I don't see why that's a problem to be honest, because the second lemming's just gonna hit this wall here and turn around anyway. I just hope that having a climber on the second bit is not insignificant. Actually, I can see why I need two lemmings, actually. Because uh, I blow one of them up, obviously. My bad, I forgot about that. I was just thinking as the lemmings were turning around themselves, I don't see what the problem is. There we go. <laughs> Notice how the basher just... Bashes out that particular block. It's like taking the middle block out on the bottom of a Jenga tower. Look. <laughs> okay, so the climber's not going to disappear. So we've got three builders remaining, one miner. So I'm just going to switch to camera two, which just shows what I'm doing from the opposite side. Okay, so they're going to all come over here now. I think it's just a case of mining up to the top of the wall. Uh, building up to the top of the wall, sorry, and then um, and I, I can I am starting to see now why there is actually a low save requirement on this level because there is nothing to counter the fact that lemmings are gonna, gonna have, probably gonna counter a fatal fall at the very top of this jump. This is gonna be a bit of trial and error, this is because um, builders are a bit hit and miss on this game. Uh, I think here is a good place to start. Yeah. It's a good job I started back as far as I did actually. 
Yeah, I don't think this is good. I don't think this is far back enough. We'll just use this as a we'll just use this as a benchmark. Four, five, six. Yeah. Let's see how many more steps he needs to lay. Yeah, okay, so you need to lay four more. So let's go four blocks back, approximately. There, there, about here, I'd say. Okay, so from the corner, of this, uh, the climber obviously climbs up. Um, <laughs> all right, so I need to do. Basically, I need to do further back than I already did, so... I need to know how many lemmings there are on this level as well, so I know how many can die, so... We already know one gets blown up by the bomber, and one's gonna, probably going to die from a fatal fall. Excuse me, I've just eaten, so... <laughs> excuse the fact that I'm nearly burping. Oh, I didn't look at how many lemmings there were. Okay. My bad. Well, I'm going to use the replay of, fu of function to start off with. Just to make sure we finish the, uh, just to make sure we cancel the replay before the builders get assigned. Unfortunately, this is as fast as the game goes. This is the fastest speed the game, game can go at. Complain about it countless times during the fun difficulty. Okay, so that's pretty much back to where we need to be now. So I've cancelled the replay. Go to camera three. There we go. Camera three is perfect as well because um, I don't think I zoomed it in at all, so just as long as I do it from back here, I'm fine. It would be helpful if I selected the builder as well. I think he's walked. I think he's walked too far forward. We'll find out. Yep. Oh, hello. He actually laid down the, I think he actually laid down the last step there, so I don't understand what's going on there. Okay. Let's just let's just try a miner to see if we can actually mine. Yeah we can. I think it's taken out the last step on the bridge though. No it hasn't, okay. Okay, so we might be in business here. We might have been able to do that. We might have been able to do that um, on the la on the previous attempt of the level. So <laughs> that's bad. That is. That was a major oversight on my part. I hope. I just hope we haven't. Um, I don't think it's too high. It would just be a groan fall, possibly. Yeah, it's a groan fall. Okay, so it's just a case of waiting for all the enemies to get to the exit. And we've got more than enough lemmings to save because uh, all the all the lemmings are walking around on the level. Yeah, so what I was saying about neo lemmings earlier. Um, well, after, after I've done with this 3D lemmings playthrough, I might start recording stuff that's uh, custom lemmings wise. You know, so it's. Lemmings uh, levels created by other people and using uh, using uh, Neo Lemmings, which is a, which is a created um, created fan game based on the original Lemmings engine on DOS. I think it's created by Namida with help from other people on the Lemmings forums. Um, yeah, and. Uh, I've tempted quite a few level packs. I started with the playing some Holiday Lemmings, you know, because I've never played the Holiday Lemmings games. And I thought, might as well do something, might as well uh, play something, 
replace something that's actually beneficially made by the Lemmings developers first before I attempt something's custom. And I've jumped straight in with a, a harder pack called Lemmings Reunion, which was created by Ishalot as I mentioned earlier. And uh, very good, very good pack. Can't recommend it enough. Um, if you want information on how to get Neo Lemmings, so I highly recommend you check out the Lemmings forums. Um, if you search for that, I'm sure you find the uh, site. Uh, I might, uh, I might end up putting it in the video description as well. If you're interested, um, basically, if you're a fan of Lemmings, you know the older get Lemmings games, um, you'll get um, you'll get a lot of pleasure out of playing Neo Lemmings. Trust me, and there's a lot of features put into it, such that you can skip back frames, single frames, and um, it just makes playing Lemmings a lot less stressful because. You know that moment where you miss assigning a builder and the lemming falls into lava or something and you've got to restart the level because of it. You know, near lemmings um, can counter things like that because you can skip back frames and rewind technically. You can't exactly rewind. You have to hold down the, the back frame button to be able to rewind. But It's quite a slow rewind function, but it's still a very good It's still a very good engine of lemmings can't recommend uh, can't recommend it enough to be honest um yeah sorry chatting too much there uh so we've got a golf graphics set level called four um i'll probably make this the last level before i uh before this uh, video ends uh 30 lemmings 20 to be saved and time them again doesn't really seem to be an issue So we can lose 10 lemmings. Okay, so we've got, uh, we've got a spring here, so for that reason we shouldn't increase the release rate. Okay, so camel one's pretty useless. I assume the lemmings are going to walk straight to the spring, so yeah, and they've gone off it. Okay, so the lemmings walk in this way. Hmm. Might have to turn him immediately. I don't need to turn the camera a bit. Yeah, there's water. There's water here. So yeah, and it's in the middle. So if we uh, turn the lemming immediately, the one has just landed. Yeah, I just do that really quickly then. Um, so we'll have to mine now. I don't think it matters so much about where you mine. Okay, so let's just have a look. Yeah, I think this is another, I think this is another simple level. I think they give you way too much turn as what you're doing. Okay, so we have to make sure we turn them at the right stage as well, because otherwise we're going to be wasting lemmings, turning them around. So we've got to do it at that second last palm tree. I'll just keep it in this. I'll just keep it at this angle, if I, unless I can't select the lemmings for some reason. Okay. I don't even, I'm not even sure if you need two builders to be honest. Oh god, I didn't have Turner selected then. Yeah. See, I like that foot. I like that feature such that. Hold on, that's not even the exit. Okay, we're not quite done yet. Okay, there's a bit of a maze thing going on down there, so we might have to use virtual. Might have to use virtual lemming. Okay. I like how fast the builders are in this game. Look. I can't, I can't stress enough that the builders, the builders in this game are really fast. It's usually the biggest pain in Lemmings, the fact that you've got to build something over water and there's like Lemmings following very closely behind you. Okay, let's see if we can spot the Lemmings when they fall in. I'm just waiting for them to fall in. Okay, 
they're about to fall in. Okay, so they're gonna come they're going to come this way. There might be an easier way if we have a look. We want the mighty to come out the middle one, I think. Yeah, the middle one's lined up perfectly with the exit. So let's see if we can spot where we need to put them. Unfortunately we can't get the cameras in here. Um, I think the idea is we've got to turn, we've got to use a turn on that guy and turn him to the, turn him to the left, his left. I, don't, I know, it's, I know that's not a very good explanation, but oh crap! It selected the wrong turner. Okay, the lemmings are trapped now, and I'm going to start the level over because of that. That's really crap, that is. You selected the wrong lemming. Unbelievable. Oh wow, those walls are destructible as well. They look they look like metal walls. It doesn't make sense that they're destructible. Thank God for the replay feature, eh? It'd be really annoying to really do all that again. The thing I find most awkward about this game is having to move the cameras around just so you know what you're doing, so. Luckily it doesn't include all the time you spend paused, so it's actually much faster than it should be. Okay. Once the build once the build is assigned, it's okay to stop the replay. Okay. Okay, we'll turn where you want. We'll turn fast forward off now. This time select the right lemming. I'm gonna, I'm gonna capture him as soon as I get him on screen. Okay, now. Okay, so we need virtual lemming now. Right. So he's got an exit right in front of him. And we can kind of see them there. Okay, so the Turner is um, pretty much. Okay, so which way is the camera pointing then? If we can, we can see the turner right there. Yeah, that's definitely the turner. Yeah, it's going to bounce him to the left. Yeah, the problem with virtual lemming is you only got this point of view. You can't zoom it in or out or anything. You can't do anything with it. You've pretty much just got this point of view and that's it. Okay. Bouncing off another wall. Okay, that, that was not good. That did not... Actually, it's perfect. I thought he was coming out the wrong side then. I've got, I've got a bit scared. Okay, for some reason I can't turn this camera. Well, let me turn this camera. That's, that's crap. Okay, I, I can now that the virtual lemming's turned off. That was nothing to do with Virtual Lemming. Virtual Lemming was assigned to camera three, not number four. Okay. Unfortunately, we can't speed up the release rate because the spring is spring is release rate sensitive. Oof, wow. Yep, that's it. Lemmings are home. All right. I think all lemons are out as well now. So it shouldn't take much too much longer. Yeah, quite a good level this is. Although the maze is a bit on the easy side. All you have to do, make sure, all you have to do is put one well-timed turn on and then that's it. The maze is done. Although if they kept, to be honest, if they kept on going and came out of this way, all you'd have to do is turn them along the edge here and you'd be able to get them around to this side either way. You'd rather keep it outside rather than inside. Okay, just turn up block three turners and we're done. Alright, so I'm going to call this a video now.
Um, in the next video, I don't know what level number we're on at the moment. I think we're on level 25. Oh, we're only on 25. Wow. So I've only done four levels in this video. Okay. Right. Next video, I'll be tackling level 25 and onwards. Probably another four or five levels. It's a computer graphic set, which is one of my favourites. So, looking forward to it.